Hey, what's up everybody? In this lesson, I'm gonna show you a hidden feature that's going to do wonders if you're trying to identify any colors, any fonts, or even create patterns at a click of a button. Now this feature is a little bit hidden, so stick with me for a second. The first thing you're gonna do is go to Window and you're gonna make sure that Libraries is selected. When you select Libraries, you're gonna find your library panel and you're gonna to wanna to go to the plus sign at the bottom of the screen. This is your Add Element tool. When you click Add Elements, you're gonna then choose Adobe Capture. Some of us may remember Adobe Capture from we used to have it on our mobile devices. Now you can access it right here in Libraries. So I can do Extract from Image and here I can actually select external files to add. If I don't wanna do that, I just wanna identify something on a flat layer, I can highlight my layer, go to extract from image, and do some amazing things. I could create patterns with my imagery, so we can do some fun stuff there. We can identify specific shapes. We can even draw a color palette right out of our element. So now you can see without using your eyedropper tool, it automatically creates a lovely color palette that you can save to your CC libraries at a click of a button. We can also do this with gradients. And the coolest feature in my mind is selecting type. So when you go to the type queue, you can go ahead and highlight over a specific typeface and go find similar fonts. And as long as you're connected to the internet, it's going to identify font recommendations based on that. So now we can see source code pro black is selected and that could be a font that I could use to match what you see on the screen. This is an absolute game changer, especially if you have an older artwork or you're trying to redesign something for your client but you don't have the layered files. I hope this tutorial helped you and happy creating.